Um, Cheers, Jack. I was just wondering if I could jump in. You mentioned riding the wave as a batsman in the middle before, and I was just wondering if you could elaborate on a few ways to sort of minimise how you go with those ups and downs. Um, yeah, we have to practice it. So, like, so you know, when you when you bat at practice, does it feel the same as a game? It depends what you're doing and how seriously you're taking it, I guess. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, hundred percent. So, what what's the difference between practice and a game? It would just have to be mindset and I guess results. Like in a training, if you get out, fuck, you're pissed off, but you get to keep going. Yeah, and that's that's right. So like you, you, know, you said mindset and and results, and like it just depends on what you're measuring. So like if you're if you're Kane and you want a bat all day, that's why he looks a bit sheepish about raising his bat for You know, because it's like that's not the goal. The goal is to place as many balls as I can. Does that make sense? So we are habitually goal orientated, and that's like 50, 100, five wickets, seven wickets. Those are the goals. Those are what we are programmed to think as success. But what if success is just facing every ball every day? What if, what if success is batting every day? What if success is bowling really, really well? Like how many times it will challenge a pump with D? What if that's success? And so if you can start doing that at practice and you start getting closer to what the game looks like, if you keep measuring success by runs and wickets, it's really, really hard to measure that because you can still bowl well and get no wickets. You can, but you can be hitting the ball well and get no runs. You can bowl an absolute show of shit and end up with six foot, but you still know you bowl a show of shit. Does that make sense? So you, so you've got to, you've got to, from a practice point of view, you've got to start measuring the things that are going to make you successful. So more process over outcome. Hundred percent. Yeah. So like, 